Do the math again. 100 minus 100? Okay, it's zero. All right, we have zero dollars left in our news team budget. And uh, if you look in here, you'll notice that there is only a coupon here to Victoria's Secret, courtesy of Holly. Oh, that's where that went. Oh, it's expired. And a Starbucks gift card with a value at 69 cents. Sorry, it was too funny to throw that away. Right, so we're broke, and new club funds don't get allocated until after the issue. Wait, so we had to pay the school to print newspapers with the school's own money? Not even the school system can avoid capitalism, Timothy. It's time for some bootstrapping. Ew, keep that to yourself. It's an expression, Holly, for digging deep, getting dirty to get the money. Ew. Guys, we have to print this week. The school is going crazy about the new nerd fight happening later today. Nerd fight? Yeah, apparently the World of Warcraft Club and the Renaissance Club are meeting to settle an old score. They've been exchanging insults, and now I think they're just going to exchange blows. All right, I want three of my people on that story. Go undercover, find the root of the problem. Billy, Tim, and Rooney. The rest of us will work on the fundraiser. Um, can I be on the fundraising team? I'm not really good at being undercover. Plus, I don't think I'd be able to keep a straight face in front of those clubs. Uh, sure, whatever, Tim. Sam, you're on the nerd story. Fitting. Don't hate me because you ain't me. Poor children. Are you all right, Mr. Daniels? It's, uh, it's just Ned Stark. Ooh, Mr. Daniels, you're in for a rough ride. Ben workroom, the room with no number, where the World of Warcraft heads meet. That's not the secret knock. Okay, I'm kicking it down. They have no respect, no talent, not even loot system. I mean. What's the point of having weapons without any stats or enchantments? Hey, turn it off! Well, uh, who started this feud? Someone on the gaming forum. Some renaissance nerd with the username GastonLive72. Gaston! Beating the beast fan. Whatever, they're gonna get it later. You with us, Rooney? Eh. Okay, so far we have a lemonade stand, Holly dressing up all sexy-like and washing cars, and a 5k run. Honestly, I think the car wash is better. And further objectify women? Not under my watch. Well, it's better than a lemonade stand. What are we, three? I don't think that 5k is gonna work out. No one wants to run for fun. Well, I mean, you can see the guy's junk in those short shorts, so... That's an idea. What, short shorts? No, junk! We get everyone on a news team to go through their stuff, and we have a one-day fire sale. We get rid of our old stuff, and we get the money to print. Well, good, because I have tons of makeup that is so 2016. I may have a few things collecting some dust. So it's decided. Tomorrow is the Attaway Appeal fire sale. Simon, text the others and let them know. I've been looking for a place to practice my combat. You encounter a lot of combat, Billy? <laughs> Let me handle this. Lords, I beckon thee. Members of the Renaissance Club, we have heard that those of the World of Warcraft has... Dude, we talk normal. We just think it's dope to fight with wooden swords and jousts. Plus, my girlfriend thinks it's kinda hot. Wait, wait, wait. Just your girlfriend, or like... All girls. <laughs> Those WoW nerds have been slinging some insults our way in the gaming forum. So basically, now we have to beat their asses. So, you on our side? Hell yeah we are. What skills do you have? Like, tongue to elbow skills? Because I got that. No. Like ass kicking. Rooney! <laughs> Ninja. Yeah, she's in. Fight. This is the big fight. Oh, 
I may have oversold this one. Uh, Matilda's gonna be so disappointed. Wait, which one do you think is Gaston Live 72? Uh, oh, did you get Matilda's text? I can finally get rid of my old socks. Dude. No. Hey, Matilda. Timothy. Um, just wanted to say your fire cell idea. Really good idea. Cool. Thanks, Tim. Oh, and Matilda? Timothy. That's all. My shirt. That's all. It's a blouse, but thanks, man. Blouse. What? These things walk downstairs. 50 cents. Uh, fine. I'll walk. All right, all right. A quarter it is. Hope it gets tangled. Where are we at? Three dollars and fifty cents. And three dollars is just from when Billy bought back his own stuffed teddy bear. Where did he go anyway? Uh, I think he went off crying. Said something about his mommy. Um, who brought the jar of blood and shrunken head? That was Rooney. It's something. Now we just have to wait for the witch doctor to show up. Tim, where's your section? Sorry, I didn't really have a lot to give. Don't have much at home, besides this silly old ring. I had an old board game, but I thought that would pass for a real jewelry. Listen, it's not the amount you all brought. It's the thought and effort you put into it. Thanks, Matilda. This is so 2016. <laughs> Ew. Oh my god. Guys, we are so screwed. Yo! Is, is that the ring of Balthazar? From the Alchemist Lair board game? Right now, I'll give you guys 10 bucks, no questions asked. Sure. Whoa, no way. That's a collectible. I'll give you 20. 40. 60. We meet again. Looks like we'll have to settle this the only way we know how. Don't get too excited. They just play some video games. $243. That's enough for a month's print. Well done, team. The appeal shall continue as scheduled. That was a real team effort. We wouldn't have been able to do it unless everyone contributed. Didn't 225 bucks come from Tim's ring of Bulbasaur or something like that? Yeah, but that's not the point. We all fought to keep the paper going. And we all brought items to the fire cell, no matter how strange. <coughs> Rooney. Principal Mathers won't get rid of us that easily. Your lip gloss, Holly? Nope, I'm bringing back 2016. Dig it. Hey, Rooney, new shirt? Beauty and the Beast. It's my jam. <laughs>